Storage of material at cryogenic temperatures is not a one-size-fits-all protocol. The environment that you choose needs to be fit for the purpose with reference to changes that will occur in the material at the temperature that you've selected. And critically, whatever temperature you select, it's imperative in terms of the removal of variability that the sample environment be maintained without variation due to either equipment inefficiency, poor control of processes, or improper handling of samples themselves. When buying cold space, the key performance indicator will always be the quality of the insulation and the latter's effectiveness as equipment ages. Insulation quality contributes to running cost, temperature gradients, and the ability to maintain temperature under stress. Minus 80 centigrade is a very common storage environment in many laboratories and institutions worldwide. It's based as a mechanical equivalent to dry ice, and to address this requirement, the Biostore 3 Cryo is now available with a temperature settable option, allowing for the full automation benefits at any temperature from minus 20 to minus 150 centigrade. Uh, these automation benefits include the protection of innocent samples during rack removal, full inventory tracking, sample access control, and exceptional hold times in emergency situations. For higher throughput scenarios or for increased sample security and tracking, the variable Biostore 3 Cryo offers significant improvements over minus 80 manual systems. For example, 96 hour hold times from minus 80 to minus 60 centigrade, a 99% reduction in power usage and zero contributed heat to room space which limits HVAC wear and power consumption are all important features. A small scale automated minus ATC store from Brooks Life Science Systems could significantly enhance the integrity of your stored samples.